Hello boys and girls, it is Dave back again and today we have some arms for you. Now you will notice that I actually have the left and right arm, um, it's actually right arm, left arm, um, laid out on the table. And the reason for this being is I think I'm going to do this in a two part. Um, part one, I already have all the magnet work and stuff done on here. Part two, um, I know you guys have asked a lot and I haven't really done that many. Um, what I'm going to do is I'm going to show you exactly what I did to lay out my magnets and everything on this side to this side. So, uh, but the first part, you know, for those that are interested and just want to see how the arm goes together, we'll do this. For those that are interested on how I do my magnet placement and everything, um, stick around for part two, which will be for the left side. Um, so starting out, let me show you the instructions. Da, 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 da. All right. So laying out here are your instructions for your uh, for your arms. Now these are showing for your uh, for your hands. The only thing that I haven't done is I haven't done magnets for uh, inside the wrist and for the hands. Uh, that's the only thing that I haven't done yet. Um, this is also showing you for the right hand, doing the optional um, gun hand or the optional closed hand. Um, closed hand. Er, Okay, so um, let me see here. I'm hoping everything's in focus here. I'm hoping. Um, let me turn off some of this crap. There. Okay, um, so starting off with now some of the parts for the shoulders. Uh, which will be one of these. Um, I don't have any magnets in because they'll just be glued in the long run. Um, and I know someone recorded this. Oh, wait, I already am. Um, that would just be a waste of magnets. Um, seeing how I've already dumped, I don't know, about 75 magnets into this so far. Um, okay, so these two pieces go together. This is your top side, your bottom. Got nice piping detail. And it will go down in there a little bit further. I'm just not shoving it down in there far enough yet. Um, next up, we have and, ah, we have this piece that will slide in just like so. Like I said, that'll get glued um, in the long run. They're not really weight bearing, so there is a slight seam right there. I'm sure that you guys can probably see it. Um, that'll just get sanded down. These pieces have not really been cleaned up except for, um, you know, and I'm going to hold off on these because these uh, are loose on there, um, except for just trimming off some of the, not all of, but just some of the, uh, the pore spouts that are on there. Um, let's see here. Next up for that, I have to look at the instructions. Look at the instructions. Yes, I was watching. Lego movie earlier. So, Sammy. Um, okay. So, this piece will go in just like so. And then this piece will go in just like so. You can already see the first magnets. All right. So, this is the socket that will go into um, the shoulder. There are um, these pieces, which I have not put in yet. Um, they're just little piston cylinders that will end up getting glued on there like that. I haven't um, put them on yet. So just bear that in mind. So we've got these. Um, you've got, where is it? This will just get... Um, glued on so it's it's not magnetized of course but it may end up coming loose now for the shoulder pieces um, you'll notice I already got some magnets in here so what we're going to do is if I grab the right side you're just going to want to line up the three holes and this is why I have bigger magnets in here is because this will be what holds the shoulders together so that they don't fall apart. So 
so we've got that. I'm going to leave that off for right now because it's loose. Once it's together, um, it'll stick on there. You have your outer shell for these. And these are just going to basically just kind of stick on there. There's no magnets. All right, so there's that portion. Now for our next, um, we're going to have this one. You'll see that it's keyed here, keyed here. So you just line up the key. There it goes. Next up, we have the elbow portion. You do want to make sure and get these correct as far as right and left, because they are kind of, of curved, as you can see. Next, we'll have the elbow piece, which will go in just like so. We have magnets here, 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 inside. There is no shortage. No shortage. Um, let me see, where were we? Um, this piece will go in. Now these do not have magnets, though they do fit very well in the slots, just as is. Next up we have this piece, which will just slip over. One small magnet just to hold it in place. And then next we have that which will also secure and hold it into place. Um, for here, if I can make sure and put it on right. Just small magnets to hold those pieces into place. So you're going to get some nice separation when you do go to paint. <clears throat> um, now comes, let's see, over here we've got the back of the hand. I've just got the standard hand on there. You just put the back plate on, kind of squeeze it down, pop it in there. There's that. And now I'm starting to regret not freaking gluing or some crap on that. Okay, now comes the really fun part. And by fun, I do actually mean fun because it was fun to uh, plot out and everything. So, we've got that magnet there, magnet there. They are going to line up. And then we've got the overplate, which you will have to finagle just a little bit. And basically, there is your right arm all completed. Uh, we'll stick that up into there. All right. Nice and simple, huh, guys? Looks good. It is a nice size and will be a lot of fun to paint. All right, so that is it for this one. What I will do is um, I will cut this video. When we come back on part two, um, I will start doing my magnet placement on the uh, left arm. And then we'll slap it on this bad boy. Then all that's left is the backpack. And finally, as I know, Evangelist really, really been waiting for. He's been salivating every post. It's been all I've been hearing is head. I think you have an obsession with head. So um, stick around, guys. I will be back and uh, probably later on tonight. Peace out.